Yo guys, I'm back with another GTA glitch video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to merge Benny's modifications from a Benny's car to any other car of your choice. So first of all you're going to need to spawn at your bunker. Okay, spawn at your bunker. I prefer to do this in invite any session. Spawn at your bunker, come down to the arena. You're gonna need the rat truck, which you can buy on the internet. Go to the arena part and buy the rat truck. You're going to need a fully upgraded Benny's car and you're going to need a car that you wanna put the modifications onto. So first step guys, get into the rat truck and click right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle. Once you've got the rat truck into the modified part, you're going to want to click circle or B and exit the vehicle. Next, bring up your phone, go to Gerald and request a job. It has to be from Gerald. So now, what you're going to want to do from here is enter the vehicle. And from here, guys, I'm going to give you a quick disclaimer. This is a very frustrating glitch. I'm not going to sit here and lie to you guys and waste your guys' time. This glitch is very, very, very inconsistent. Keep that in mind. So what you're going to want to do from here, once you've exited the vehicle and you've got back in the vehicle, you're going to want to click right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle. You're going to want to click the gas straight after and half a second after you've clicked the gas, you're going to want to click left on the D-pad. So basically the main game here, you've got to click left D-pad to return the vehicle to storage. After you've done the right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle, click the gas and you have to click left just before that mod menu pops up saying um, that all the armor and stuff. So once you have hit it correctly, as you can see on screen that you did see my vehicle just come straight back into the garage with the name of the vehicle on the bottom right hand corner. From now, once you have hit that part, you're going to want to exit the vehicle again. You're going to get, want to get the gelled job ready and get back in the vehicle. So from here, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to do the pause method. So you're going to want to hover over the invitation just before you accept it. You're going to want to click pause or hold pause, should I say, and click X to accept the job straight away. You should hear the click from the job of you entering the job once you're on the pause menu. So once you have done that, when you hit it or when you think you've hit it, get back in the vehicle and it should only say modify your vehicle and not send back to storage. Now you're going to want to head over to any vehicle that you're putting the modifications onto and click right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle. So from here, you're going to want to just exit the vehicle, click circle or B and exit the vehicle. Get in the rat truck and send the rat truck back to storage. Now from here, you're going to want to get in the vehicle that has the Benny's modifications. You're going to want to click right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle and take it into the mod shop. Now once you have taken that car into the mod shop, you're going to want to click circle or be on Xbox and exit the vehicle. Now you're going to want to get in the vehicle that you want to put the modifications onto and do the pause method again. Click on the Gerald job. When you're hovering over the accept invitation, you're going to want to hold pause and click X straight after so you hear the click of the job and the pause menu at the same time. When you have hit that, you're going to want to click circle and spam left on the D-pad and you should see a quick glimpse of the modifications transferred onto the car. Now, as you can see, all of the modifications are on the car. I have the wheels and all of that. 
Uh, you can change the liveries, do whatever you want. But once you have hit the glitch and the car is here outside of the mod shop, get into the car, click right on the D-pad to modify the vehicle and change anything on the vehicle that saves it. So in this case, I'm going to be changing the brakes. Once you've done that and changed a part on the car, you're going to want to exit the vehicle again. Now guys, I'm going to show you how to do this rinse and repeat. You do not need to do the first step again. So get into the car that you just put the mods onto and return it to storage. So now from here guys, you're going to want to put any other car of your choice that you want to put the modifications onto. In this case, I did just buy a car. I'm going to enter the mod shop by clicking right on the D-pad. Now just to warn you guys, you cannot transfer multiple times with one car. So what you're going to have to do is get in the car that you've just done it with. You're going to want to return this car to the storage. Now, once you have returned the Benny's car to the storage, you're going to want to grab another Benny's car. It has to be in your workshop. So here, as you can see, I'm going to get in the Frax. I'm going to take it into the mod shop, click right on the D-pad to modify the car. And now once you've got the car into the mod shop, you're going to want to just exit the vehicle again by clicking circle or B. Get into the car that you want to put the modifications onto and do the same step. Open up your phone, hover over the Gerald invitation, hold pause, and when you release the pause button, click X to accept the job. And you should hear the click and the pause at the same time. And as you can see, you saw a quick glimpse of the modification is just transferred onto the car. So guys, this is a very, very easy glitch, but very inconsistent glitch. Okay, so just bear that in mind. Do this at your own risk. You are doing dirty dupes, so do this at your own risk. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, please smash that like button, comment what you think and what you want to see next, and please subscribe to your boy. It's been your boy Laser, and I'm out. Peace.